You're a genius. Who would have thought that honey Dijon mustard would make the perfect suntan lotion? But it's nothing compared to this insta grow spray you invented last week. Him hightail it out of here. Well, I think they finally left. They might be downstairs. We better check the surveillance system. What kind of earthling is that? Well, I guess I'll have to look it up in the big book, O oh, Humans. Good grief! I struck bee dirt! It's the mother load. Let's do some ciphering and see how much it's worth. Twelve bucks! Great jumping corn cobs! That's ten times what we made last year. We'll be rich! This old house must be the perfect spot for keeping bees. I guess we done found ourselves a permanent bee farm. It's time for one of us to go down there and do something. Yeah, me. Yeah, I'll go. <laughs> okay, gorgeous. You go down there and kick thorax. Oh, dear, brave, strong, gorgeous. <laughs> la, 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 la. Hi, I'm Billy Joe Bob uh, Goober. Uh, you know, I'm trying to earn my animal husbandry badge by working hard for little pay. Okay, Goober, you're now the official bee wrangler, so I'm leaving you in charge. Now remember, take good care of my bees. <laughs> What's he doing? That gorgeous is brilliant. By eating all the honey, he'll drive the bee guy into bankruptcy. He'll have to move out. If small bees make a little honey, big bees make lots of honey. <laughs> now he's using the enlarging vaporizer spray. Now that's what I call bees. <laughs> Just look at those honey and gorge beauties. I'm back. Did my little honeys miss your dad? <laughs> hey, I uh, hope you got the extra large bag of beach chow. <laughs> wow, Goober, I don't know how you did it, but you're gonna make me rich. And as a reward, I'm gonna double the pay you give me. Gee.
some bankruptcy, that traitor Gorgeous has made that bee guy a millionaire. Well, burn my brisket. Just look at all that beautiful money. I'm a gazillionaire. At this rate, by next week, we will have cornered the honey market. Yeah, we can go public. Wall Street, here we come. Who's there? Yes, I'm Mr. Pesnickety with the Government Health Department. I've come to inspect your bees for mad bee disease. Certainly. We'd be glad to show you our facilities. See how fat and healthy they are? Hmm. That bee is behaving rather strangely. I'm afraid this bee has mad bee disease. I'm afraid the entire herd will have to be destroyed. You don't have to wipe out all of them, sir. Let me put him out of his misery so that the others may live. Hey, yeah, no. How about next time you wear the bee costume? Come along, peaceable like. Oh. This plan can fail. Candy captures the queen, leads her far away from the house, and the stupid worker bees will follow her anywhere. It's so simple, really. I'm worried about the bees. They're all so depressed. Who knew that we would overproduce and create a glut on the honey market? We need a break. Something new, big and exciting. Hot dogs. Get your jumbo hot dogs. Hot dogs. Hot dogs. Hot dogs. Amazing! How many do you sell a day? About six thousand. Wow! Isn't that hey, boss! Forget, honey. We want to go into the hot dog biz. Check out these numbers. Hot dog! This is just the break we need. There's gold in them. There, dogs. Hip hip! Hey! Well, Goober, it's been a real kick in the teeth. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> hey, guys, it's me! I'm back! <laughs> oh, dear gorgeous, thank you for saving us from those horrid bees. How awful it must have been for you to have to betray your friends for money the way you did. Oh, that's crazy. How could I ever have done such a thing to my friends? You'll never betray your friends, right? <laughs> oh, my pals! Yes? I'm sorry, old pal. I guess we misjudged you. Welcome back. <laughs> Because we didn't know if you would come back, we we saw the fridge. And as you seem to prefer sweets to savouries, we got rid of your stock of borscht. Oh, and by the way, we've cancelled your sushi magazine subscription too. La la 
Cause the monsters are coming, the monsters are coming, the monsters are coming, they're coming into your house, and I want all you little French kids out there.